Alright, we are good to go. I'll just pop out chat for a second here. Alright, what's up everyone? I'm Corrupts here, and tonight and we're back with more Monster Hunter World. Uh, we're still fairly early on in the game. Uh, I honestly don't really have a good metric for how far we are, but I have just finished about with the 8th or 9th uh, monster. Or big unique monster. That Die being hard, the uh, Toby... Kadachi. Toby Kadachi is what we just fought. And boy was he a difficult fight for me. Uh, right now, we actually have a critical quest to go take on the Engineth, finally. So we might do that. Um, I'm going to take a quick look at what we have uh, for optional quests first, to make sure there's nothing outstanding that we should clear out first. And then if not, we'll go take on the Engineth. Alright, so optional. Nope, we've got nothing in optional. Uh, investigations, all I have on me right now is a bunch of uh, best void kills. And I could technically go do to the fat, which wouldn't take a huge amount of time. And it is an event quest, so maybe we'll take on this first, just to warm up for today. And then we'll take on the encroaching engine off. Uh, let's see. Do I have any information in my log about the engine off? got a new monster that I don't know what the hell this is. Alright, Diabolos, we have not even touched you, nor have we touched... Oh, we haven't even touched the engine either. Oh, shit. Alright, so, it's very weak to water. Yeah. Yeah. Engine I've heard... Uh, yeah, you can see his stats right here. Okay, so, uh, Anjanath is very weak to water, which is excellent because I'm currently using a water bow. Uh, so, much like Toby Kadachi, who's very weak to water. Um, in terms of that stuff, I'm pretty much kitted out for weapons. Um, oh, actually. Let's check uh, Anjanath. Paralysis is, you know, it's pretty average for everything. Um... We should find uh, some armor stuff for me, because I can't remember what this armor is weak to. And if it's fire, I definitely need to switch it out. Uh, so let's go change equipment. Alright, let's see. Uh, Vespoid is pretty weak to fire. Okay, so we're going to want to switch to something else. Uh, before we do that, shit, I need to check what kind of arrows this bow can use. Uh, equipment info, there we go. Alright, so, aqua arrow can only use close range and power? Really? I thought this was, was my elemental, or my status effect bow. Shit. Manage items. Let's ditch you, ditch you. I did not realize I had all of this crap in my inventory still. Ditch some raw meat, some rations, some little on steaks. Don't need these on me right now. Alright, so let's pull out. 25 power coatings. Because I'm going to get 25 more in this quest. I don't have to worry about buying poison or paralysis or anything like that, so that's nice. Well, it's not nice, but it would actually be very useful. 
Alright, so we'll go to the workshop and see if we can get ourselves a better set of armor for this fight. Because I can't remember the Anjanath's moveset. So I don't know how often it actually uses those fire attacks. Let's go forge armor. What do we have that's good versus fire? Kuki doesn't have any negatives versus fire, but that's not really what we're looking for. Allies weak to fire. Neutral fire. Neutr negative fire. Negative fire. Good against fire. Alright, so we might just set ourselves up with a bone set. It's a little low on the defense rating, but... Worst case scenario, we can just, like pop a couple armor spheres into this stuff. I don't have a lot of them, but, you know, whatever. Uh, yeah, so let's uh, gear up in the bone set, I guess. I don't need to make this because I already have it in the, the, the box. Excellent. Um, so we've got our armor set done. Let's change our Palico stuff. Actually, I should have everything I can make for the Palico right now. Yep, sure do. So I just need to change his armor. Alright. Um, right, right, right. I wanted to upgrade the armor stuff. So, why are these so far separated? That's weird. I'm actually going to burn through both of my armor spheres. That's kind of weird. But that's fine. I mean, for right now, it's not a terrible thing. Because once we get enough materials for the engine to have actual armor, that'll probably last us for <coughs> most of low rank. So, we'll have plenty of time to re-gear up and get some other armor spheres and whatnot. Alright, we just need to eat, and then we're going to go take on the Anjanath. Uh, let's pull the quest first. Oh, you know what? Oh no, I didn't mean to sell those! Oh, booty. Alright, well, let's... I can't change my Palico armor here. That goes to the Hunter's Gathering. 
Can I change my palico gear here? <laughs> could if I made more, but I don't need to make more when I already have most of the stuff that I can make. Um, I can do it in the field, so let's just do it there, I guess. It's kind of like the worst way to do it, but whatever. It gets it done. Alright, alright, alright. Let's uh, grab Anginav quest. Sign to Anginav. Yeah, let's go here. We're gonna use a voucher. Alright, what's fresh today? I'll take you. new, but it's not fresh. And I guess we'll take a fishy item to get that attack up and defense up. Allows the hunter to recover quickly when sent flying. Prevents you getting me knocked on your butt. Confirm. Yeah. Our bonuses aren't great, but, you know, whatever. Oink. A lobster, a whole turkey, a giant steak. Oh, that's a meal right there. Anjaneth, we're coming for you, bro. We're coming for you. We gonna get you. Gonna get you. Our number one priority is to secure the base by taking out that encroaching Anginath. Use everything at your disposal. That's the way it works here in the New World. All right, let's up your fire defense as much as we can. Your fire defense is already as high as it goes. Awesome. A massive protector shield used to defend against attacks. It can also be used to provoke monsters drawing their attention. Guard effectiveness increases with proficiency. Oh. Well, for right now, we're going to stick with the Vigor Wasp Spray, since that's my most effective item. And why change it now when we're fighting such a scary monster? Whee! Oh, shit, I should actually have hit the box first. That's my bad. Throwing knives? Really? Just standard throwing knives. I mean, whatever, man. Whee! Alright, engine of footprints. Oop. More footprints. 
Wait, they're going up here, though. And yet the scout flies are leading me away from where the footprints are going. Makes sense. Let's see, now I'm curious because I saw a marker. Oh, yeah, see, that's the green. What's that green marker? Oh, it's an old war... or... Wyvernian? What are those? I've got a couple of them now, but I have no idea what they do. Is he eating the Jagras? He is eating the Jagras. <laughs> you show off that booty. That Jagras is dead, son. Very large. Oh, he got me again! Oh shit, he got me again! Right, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. Oh, I'm gonna skin this fucking Jagras, that's for sure. on his tail. Yoink. He went up? Really? to jump all the way down. Ooh. 
dude! Okay, that wombo is kinda cheap. Dude, you're like leaping through the world. I... okay. This fight's gonna be a little bit more difficult than I thought it was gonna be. Ooh, dude! Engine is intense! God, where is, am I? Jesus, you covered that distance way faster than you probably should have. Holy lord. I want you back over here, bud. Come on.
facing in this direction. much of that part going left. Let's top up. Dude, Anjanath, where are you going, bro? You were, like, doing the long route to wherever you're going. I'm, like, so surprised that Wrath didn't take shots at him. He's mad right now. Damn it. Oh, 
too. Oh my god. Oh my god. Really? Through the floor he grabs me. That is some actual nonsense. What is actually happening here? Oh my god, why can't I move? That legit sounded like a fart. Like a sad, wet fart. Oh, he's hurting. Yeah, we're not gonna get this sub 20 minutes, but that's fine. Is he running to the Wrath Nest? Why would you run to the Wrath Nest? That's really dumb. The Wrathian will kill you. Or wait, no, this would be Wrath Thelos? Dude, yeah, he's like totally running to that Wrath Nest. You're gonna get yourself murked, bro. Oh, wait, no, it's, this isn't that. Where are we? Oh, wait, maybe it is. Because he keeps fucking climbing. Oh my god, you're, s you're climbing so far away. Dude, you're climbing so far away. It's a bomb pot. Powerful type of slinger ammo that can do some serious damage.
whatever. Oh, if that hit, that actually probably would have killed me. Jesus. Oh my lord. Man, that was intense as all oh, fuck. Holy Christ. Man. This. Monster Hunter World ramps up in the middle. Holy Jesus. Toby was intense. Anjaneth was intense. That is crazy. <laughs> I mean, I'm glad I got through it, but damn. Intense. Oh, I got fuck all for parts, too. I mean, I got metric fuck tons of scales, but... No large bones, no other materials. A new upgrade level is now available for armor. Hell yeah, it is. But oh my goodness. Good lord. Good lord. Oh, wow, an actual loading screen. Haven't seen one of those since, like, I started the game. Gather round, people. We have much to discuss. All our preparations are complete, and I have all of you to thank for working double time to make it happen. I'm especially impressed with the fifth for hunting the Anjanath despite being new here. That's one less misery standing between us and capturing Zora Magdaros. Well done. When will dun, dun. Zora reach the Great Ravine? Precisely at daybreak. Good. Let's run through the operation one last time, then. Our hunters will rendezvous on site. Once the beast appears, the operation will commence. We've built two barriers in the target's path. Your objective is to stop it at the first barrier, initially wearing it down with cannon and ballista fire, then restrain it with binders. However, there is a chance it will break through. If so, will initiate the mounting phase of the operation. During this phase, we'll attempt to weaken it further, so that we'll have a better chance of... Make sure you hammer it as much as possible with cannons and ballista. They're there for a reason. Affirmative, sir. Cannons and ballista. Technicians, make sure you do a final check on the equipment before we begin. Yes, sir. Quartermasters, conduct an inventory on our supplies. Researchers, proceed to the Great Ravine with your escort as soon as you're ready. We can't bring our quarry back to base, so take what you need and be prepared to conduct your research on site. Don't worry, Commander. Everything will be in order. Keep your ears open during the operation. I'll be giving orders as the situation unfolds. May the Sapphire Star light your way. Dismissed. May the Sapphire Star light your way. Dun, wow. dun, 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 the big dun, dun, moment dun, is dun, finally dun, dun. here. I'm shaking up storm here. How about you? Oh yeah, the huntsman's not here anymore. Or he's gone again. Still? Gone still. 
we can accomplish anything! Nice. I have to turn in literally the only pelt that I got. Awesome. New world settler. Rathian scales monster bone L. Only needed. Yeah, I actually did need large bones. Seriously, I used the only two large bones that I got. Son of a. That's on me for not actually making sure I was doing what I was supposed to be doing. Oh, this wants me to hunt four Anjanath? Oh shit, I didn't realize that's what that was. What, that's what that was. Damn, son. These ones take two levels, or two missions to complete. Uh, Poogie! Who is my big fat piggy? You are. I don't have any extra Poogie clothes. That's lame. Dun 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 dun. Oh, I. It's circle to pet the poogie. Damn it. No, I've angered the poogie gods. No. Done goofed. I done goofed. <laughs> Go carefully. Hunched off. King of the skies, Queen of the land. Zora Magdros. Pelt scale fang nose bone. Nose bone? Oh, that inflatable thing. So break the head to get some fangs. Cut the tail to cut the tail. Dirt. Drop material fangs. do chew the fat, I can't use this bow because it's water. So that would be a very bad idea. So if we're gonna go do chew the fat, I did it again. I gotta stop running up these stupid stairs. It takes too freaking long. That's what Time I want to do. for some hard graft. I still have just the two base weapons. Anja! Oh, all those materials. Oh my goodness. So two, four, six. Wait. Shit. Nine. So I have literally all the Ange scales I need to make this. The whole set. I'm just missing six, eight, nine, ten pelts. Two flame sacks, one tail, two nose bones, and two large monster bones, and one plate. 
Yes. Of a Bizarch. That is some good looking armor though. Increases the power of each attack by 10% and reduces Wervin's fire cooldown by 15. Oh, here we go. Strengthens the explosive attacks like gunland shells, Wervin's fire, charge blade file attacks, and sticky ammo. Temporarily reduces stamina depletion when health is at 40% or lower. Oh, that's a set bonus. Okay. Oh, none of these have set bonuses. Oh. Cool. I didn't realize set bonuses were a thing. Let's see. Fire attack, marathon runners, special ammo boost. Increases the power of bow gun, special ammo, and dragon piercer. Nice. Ooh. Fire resistance, that's without saying. Oh, look at the def base defense on that. It's double what my upgraded bone set is. That's insane. I'm like, what's the best that I have right now? Just In terms of physical defense, the best full set of armor I have is the upgraded bone set. That is not great, to be honest. Like, I can make individual pieces of a lot of sets. But I can't make the whole set of, like, anything. <laughs> Except for alloy. But I might not even be able to make the alloy set. Yeah, I've got enough materials for that. But it's just not very good. <laughs> Shit. Um, yeah, I forgot to check. But, uh, I could make a thing for my little kitty. And if I have new upgrades available. Monster Bone L. And of course I actually needed one of those. Damn it! Oh, that's... That's some pretty decent raw damage. Not gonna lie. Blazing Bow. Anjanath. Blooming Arch, that's Pooky Pooky. Pooky Pooky! One fifty six base damage, two ten fire. Oh, woof. Oh, it's got like jaw fragments on the top. That's actually pretty cool. Oh, dang. Take on Chew the Fat, I think. So I'm going to ditch some stuff in the box. And we're going to pull out some items. I actually don't have all that many potions. A sleep blast. Still can't use poison on any of these bows. Ah, here we go, poison. 144 base damage. Let's go with the 144 base. Really? Chainmail's actually got water resistance? Water. I don't terribly need the water resistance. The Jagras doesn't really use water attacks like, almost ever, so. That's not going to be terribly an issue. Um, I legitimately forget already if this thing can use power ammo, so I'm just going to do a quick check. Alright, so no power, but I can use paralysis and poison, so let's go buy both of those. Let's 
buy as much as I can carry of both. We got this. actually can't hold very much of either. <laughs> but hopefully it'll be enough to get each monster uh, poisoned and paralyzed one time each. Um, Alright, let's head back up, get us some food in our ability, and then we'll take on Double Jagras. Which, after Anja and Toby, should be a joke. Hopefully. <laughs> You know, until the j another Jagger shows up in the middle of this fight. Fresh ingredients already. Fantastic. Nothing can stop us. Let's go hunt us a double Jagras. Double Jagrin, let's get it going. Really wish this would actually give me some elemental ammo types. <sighs> Alright. Let's go easy ration. Jagras, Jagras, where is the Jagras?
still on target. Oh, that's Engine F. Strong. I little. I just fought him for the first time. Man, I was not expecting him to be as difficult as he is. How did I sneak on the cart four times before he kicks your ass out? <laughs> Fair enough. Yeah. No. Uh, he didn't kill me, which I was surprised. He came close twice, but. <laughs> Send them an invite. Uh, you can start an online session at the bounty board, the squad, stuff like that. Alright, let's go find where that Jagras went, because I'd rather not have to deal with the uh, Engine F2. Alright, Jagras went this way. Let's start off with the poison. Is the Jagras below me? Oh, Jagras is below me, okay. Yo, kitties, can I get some help, please? Spent much time in the ancient forest in a while, so I legit forgot this was down here. All right. Definitely poisoned. Is he already dead? Oh my god, he's already dead. What a little... Oh my god. Jagras, you ain't shit, bro.
Damn, Jagras, you ain't shit. Alright. Let's go find Jagras number dose. Oh, and it just dropped right on us. Uh oh. Alright, he doesn't really care we're here. That's good, that's good, that's good. Footprints, but I need Jagger's footprints. There we go. Probably wasn't a great idea to come back over here, but you know, what else? <sighs> Seriously, where's the second Jagger so? Surely it won't be down here. Nothing, nothing, nothing. That all just goes the same place. Hmm. I mean, I don't think I've ever seen a Jagras this far into the forest, but... There's a bunch of water here. Hmm. Oink. Totally didn't need it, but I'll take it regardless. Man, where is the second Jagras? I to like, if they were close together, I totally could have had this done in like... In ten minutes. Uh, 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 we might be. Ah, there we go. That's rude. Don't 
run away. Uh oh, I'm wasting my paralysis coating. No. Ain't nothing. Ain't nothing. Jagras ain't shit. These guys had to be scaled down. There, there's no way normal Jagras has that little health. That, that felt way too fast. Aside from having to chase the second one down for 10 plus minutes. using the wildlife. <laughs> oh man. Dead or shrugged. I still almost had it done in under 10 minutes. God damn. Alright, main scale, high claw. Main scale, scale, scale. Bone, claw, hide, hide. Main. <laughs> Got way more mains than I need. Ah, oh, close. Tail rider. We are known as the bug catchers. Dun, 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 dun. Let's check my botanical. Uh. <laughs> Go carefully. Trust me, the rewards will be worth it. I mean... Maybe? Although I did get a lot of mains, so... That, that's fair. Let's see how much of the Jagras stuff I can make. Not that I terribly need or want it, but... Hey, if I can make it, why not?
So two hides, four hides, five hides, six hides, seven hides. Uh, if nothing else needs, oh no, I need one more main to be able to make the whole set. Speed Eating, Intimidator, Palico Rally, Fortify, Speed Crawler. Like, it's a decent looking set, it's just like... very low level. Although, it's water defense is pretty good. So, it wouldn't be terrible for if you wanted to go farm Jira. Just to make it a little bit easier on you. But... Really, even Jira doesn't really do that much water damage. Um, is there a Jagger's tree? I think there's a Jagger's tree for bows. Like, oh, what's the point? Meh. <sighs> All right. We're going to switch back. So we're going to take Honestly probably not gonna need anything that's in the box. But I do want to switch back to my Food in our bellies. Oh, it's nutrients if that makes. Okay. And we'll go customize. Let's look for all the raw fresh ingredients. Stick with the meat. One for the history books. Questo accept. Questo, 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 quest. Ho!
This is gonna work. Chief! Commander! So? We'll get it ready by morning, I promise. I'll hold you to it. When the time comes, you know what to do. The operation will commence at daybreak. Daybreak. <laughs> Sounds like we got our work cut out for us, eh, old man? Was that his dad? By I next that's moonrise, gotta be his dad. Zora will be in chains. Zora, back to us. Is this going to be one of the classic Elder Dragon type kind of fights? With like the Dragon Lancer or whatever the hell it's called? Oop, scout flies are going ape shit. Magdros is on his way. Wait, is Magdros already here? Nope, Magdros is on his way, okay. Comes up through the ground like it's nothing. Jesus. Get to your posts now! <sighs> Use the cannons and bullet time. Wear the beast down! Kitty, load that cannon with me. Oh no, where are the cannonballs?
Oh, it broke this trap here. Oh my goodness. It's time to restrain this beast. Ready your binders. Climax. The binder is on top of the barrier. Fire it from the ballista when you're ready. My cat, I can really help use some help loading this ammo. It's still not weak enough to capture, sir. Six, five. to a hitching post. Yo! 
Jouik. Run it back, old man! Give us some orders! Find the magma cores on Zora's shell. Those were its weak points, so if you attack them, it'll wear the beast down. Watch out for that magma! It's spewing out of those cores! Oh, That's this like. That hurts. Hell, these things are slinging. <laughs> Ooh, pardon me. Sorry about that. Oh my god, I'm going inside his body. getting upset. It's changing posture. I think it's trying to get up. Stay calm and focused. Just keep looking for those magma cores. Are you okay? We've spotted huh? another core on Zora Magdros' head. Right. Hunters, make Prince head and attack that core with all you've got. You say hunters plural, but like, I'm the only hunter I've seen so far. Get ready to resupply the hunters! It's time! Understood!
one's being a little bit more stubborn. Also, if I'm supposed to be looking for his head, this is very much not his head. That was a big hit. I assume. Okay, that's enough. Put it towards the second barrier. Hunters, hold your position. Watch your footing, or it'll shake you off. I don't climb this. I suppose they don't climb this, okay. I'm honestly not 100% sure what I'm supposed to do here. Dragonite ore. Hell yeah, that's what I want to find. Aha, that's what I was hoping to find. Yeah, give me that Dragonite ore. This is a long encounter. Holy crap. I have no goddamn idea where I am. Do I climb up this?
the hell? Oh good, because I'm definitely going to need their help. Oh, thank Jesus. <laughs> I am very much not geared to take on... Nerf got there right now. Not even close. Come on! Back in position! Now! I still don't understand how Nerf Gaunt is technically an Elder Dragon. That makes no Aim. sense. Too small for you to be an elder dragon. Yeah! Oh, this dude's about to get killed. Like straight merch. Hey, huntsman. Master about to get murked. Back. No way. Rip. Nope. Not quite. He's using a Rathian sword too. Magdurus is not happy. Got away. I'm getting too old for this. <laughs> That's a really fun fight. Carapus, Carapus, Magma, cool. Dragonite ore, Armor Sphere Plus, Bones, Trap Tools. Plura. Obtained by breaking its chest. Used to craft armor. Magma. Magma. Liquid hot magma.
All right, gather around. Let's get council underway. Let's get council First underway. Since it reached the Great Ravine, we've lost track of it, sir. How do you lose track of it? it quite difficult for it's us. like 300 feet tall. However, I think we have a chance to salvage the situation if we can pick up its trail on the other side. We've got some good news from the field team on that front. Tectonic movement from when Zora passed through created a fissure in the Great Ravine. That fissure is our ticket to catching up with the beast. There's no point. We exhausted our supplies during the last operation. Even if we did track it down, there's no way we'd be able to pull off anything of that scale. Hmm. Then what should we do, Commander? What if we reconvened with the third who've been missing for 30 years? We'll have to send a ship to the guild. A ship? But with the skies and seas the way they are. It doesn't matter. We cannot proceed without notifying the guild. We should send word and wait for their decision. Captain, can I count on you? Never you worry, sir. I've been watching the sea churn and waiting for my chance to tame her again. It seems that the fissure in the Great Ravine has not only given us a path, but an opportunity as well. Together, we're going to brave whatever lies on the other side and find Zora Magdaros's trail. Hunters, head to the Great Ravine as soon as you're ready. May the Sapphire Star light your way. Dismissed. Is the Great Ravine gonna end up being a like exploration zone? Cause that'd be pretty neat. New specialized tool was added. Help hey me. partner, let's go on an expedition out in the Great Ravine. Oh, uh, so along. it's going to be an exploration zone. Awesome. Hmm. I wonder. <laughs> well, that could have ended badly. Really? You don't say. Never would have guessed. Boogie! Oop, they got new gear in stock. New products in stock. What are you buying? Whew, those barrel bombs are expensive. Gunpowder fish bait. Ooh, blast coating, ice. Pow pow. Laid back bonus. What you got, for me, bro? Hurry back now. Hunter Rathian. Uh, damn it. Rathians aren't nice, though. Got some new stuff in stock. Get that new stock in. Like, I don't think there's any shop in a game that's less used than that one. Alright, so this one can only go up this tree right now. 
this one, hey, goes into steel bow one. Ooh, that's pricey. Oh, that rarity actually up increased. Up increased, increased. Derp. All right, so this can turn into whatever this is, and this is definitely the Rathian bow because Rathian scales, obviously. Increases base damage by 12 and elemental damage by 30. I would just need to maybe hunt two Jurototus. Alright, so I need to go either buy or make another Hunter's Bow. I need to make one to turn into the Pookie Pookie, then one to make it the Anjanath, and then another one, so I need at least one, two, three more bow two. I want this one so bad, though. That's so strong. Oh, that looks awful. Just truly ridiculous. Increases the gun lance's shell capacity and charge blade's file capacity. Well, no. Increases firepower of ballistae and cannons. So they go from 150 damage crit to... 165? It's not that great of an increase. Buy three bone bows. Oh, I didn't need three, I only needed two. Shit. Well, whatever. Oh, 
<sighs> Alright guys, that's going to be it for me for tonight. Uh, thanks a lot for everyone who tuned in. Remember, I am, I am corrupt. You can like, follow, subscribe on Twitch, Twitter, YouTube, all that jazz. You can find the links down in the description. You can catch me Thursday to Sunday, 6 to 7 p.m. Pacific time. As always, that's probably just a guideline. 6 is definitely a start point, but 7 is pretty flexible. Tonight we ended at uh, uh, 8.20ish, which is a little over 2 hours, which is a little over our, you know, normal average, but that's fine, because we're having fun, and that mission was really long. <laughs> but that's okay. I was having fun. Anywho, you guys have yourself a good night. I'll be back later. Have a good night, and toodles.